Welcome everybody to the Jefferson County Fairground and we are at the Farming Simulator 22 of the announcement of the, of the Brass to the Bone Gaming Odyssey and it's the Brass to the Bone Polos. And it's in the afternoon and in like evening time we are going to have the, the tractors, we're going to have cage tractors, we're going to have John Deere pulling tractors. Those two are going to be voting each other. And now we are just checking everything out, boys and girls, and just sit back, relax, and enjoy yourself, and just enjoy the show. We're just making sure everything is working properly, and Making sure everything running pretty good with our John Deere buggy and the of the tractor pulls of the ledger pulling sled of the 7,700 of the weights is how much the pulling sled is holding. We're just making sure everything is good and good to go. And hopefully everybody had a good weekend enjoying themselves. And yes, it is. It's a really nice sunny and cloudy day. Even there was a chance in, chances like a high chance of rain like later on of tonight at the Farming Simulator 22 of the PA at Jefferson County Fair. And we're taking a pull and sledding of the tractor and get it all ready to go and get him ready get the others pulling slay ready to go as well as do, as to give me a like comment and subscribe if you had dislike it's okay and we just appreciate that as well as too we just appreciate anything or just how much of viewing as long as people are having fun, having a good time, enjoying themselves, and enjoying the show, boys and girls, and the country farmers, while we are getting everything our way to go for everybody in Fox and, and get the polling sled and the uh, safety crew of the ambulance and the fire rescue is our way to go and John Deere tractors and even the uh, Case tractor with that water. Well, the water will do on that tanker. I don't even know what's the name of it. Don't have no clue about it. And this is back to the bone. Give me an RC with a announcing of the back to the bone pullers. And yes, indeed, it's a pulling of the Trucking tractor pulls and last year will be the semi trucks. Boys and girls. And we got the pulling sled eyes all ready to go. And we just we jump it back into this one and move it back. It might be for the semi trucks or the pickup truck, which I don't even have no clue like about it, but we will find out of the good of the show. And we are just parking it right here at a good spot. And we are just getting everything ready to go. And we're getting our work on and hopping in the, that case tractor. And he's going to use a joystick and push it straight down. Then all the water will come out and will watering the track down so it wouldn't be a lot dusty and now the water will be beginning to spraying but everybody's sitting back wherever just chilling relaxing enjoying themselves and just whatever they are eating and drinking well they're just enjoying like a good time of youtubing and watching 
Great show events uh, anywhere at Back to the Run Gaming RC. In the water world and spring round, the tractor will, of that work will be going up and they're going straight back down. Then the national anthem will be coming. Just sit back, relax, enjoy yourself. Have a great show. At Lord Jefferson County Fairground. For the family, family, 22. With the other one, you can check out. It was a really good, great event at the Farming Simulator 22 with the camping down there. And it was a great work with all the workers and the team for all the came for. You can check that out on Back to the Bone Gaming LC. And in the race day, for at the All Factor NWS National Cup Cars at the Batman 400. And you can check out the other one as well as too. Like the Dirt Track Racing and the other Dirt Royals. And we appreciate it and appreciate all. And appreciate uh, so much of the viewing. And we appreciate it a lot better for everybody to just give it a thumbs up. Even it's okay if you get, give it a thumbs down. And even there will be more down the road just whenever there's going to be more Farming Simulator 22 of the Truck and Tractor Post event. There's going to be some like the pickup truck won't be wanting. There's going to be some special events. We just went, never know and we will find out until at the USA of the pulling trucking tractor poles at the East Coast. And we will have special events as well as to and we're upcoming as well. And the tractor of that worker is coming down and we are getting ready and the worker is checking out case tractor. Not our case tractor my bad. What's that about that everybody? Boys and girls, it's a John Deere. In the back of it, it will have the like American flag. If you want to, you can be respectful of just sitting, you will actually enjoy yourself or put your hands on your heart for the good national anthem. But I don't even own it, but I kind of like it. I thought it was really cool. I kind of give them just a great shout out to them as well as to when they get to the national anthem. And it will be almost time for the national anthem. Everybody boys and girls.
Have a full structure and saw a black thunder and that driver will be going up on the way station everybody boys and girls and let's see how much that case tractor is weighing and that driver with a black black thunder rolling thunder I was meant to say and excuse me and pop me from that it's a rolling thunder, and that's how much that tractor of that case international is weighing. We thought it was a black thunder, but it's a rolling thunder. We just got a confused uh, mixed up, and it, with a paper with the announcing of a Brad to the Bone, Jamie and RC, and it's a Brad to the Bone. All the polling. And Rolling Thunder is meeting up with the polling sled. And we're just getting away a while. 
With our drama backing up going forward. While we just all sit back, relax, and enjoy ourselves. Drinking and eating delicious uh, food with a yummy snack. Well, I am announcing everything in of the voice recording at the Farming Simulator 22 uh, Jefferson County Fair at the PA. And the driver was fixing in and organizing Getting the front of the chain of the pulling sled all uh, fixed up. And the worker was telling the, the driver, like, hey, go go off to the side and we'll hook up and just straight it out. Pull straight, driver, of the wall and thunder. And Rolling Thunder is falling in straight, straightening out everything. They have to go, they can straight down, down the path of the pulling track. And it's, uh, Rolling Thunder. We have to get the front tire up, we have to get the front tire up. And that tractor is... Probably like fixing everything with the, the pulling sled driver and the worker. And the front of the tires is going up. Be safe out there and have fun. Be careful out there. When you drop your foot down on the gas pedal, and we will drop the green. If anything can happen, we will throw a red flag. And let's see how far Rolling Thunder can go down the track. And this is the clouds are rolling in. Afterwards, it's going to be thundering. Afterwards. And everybody is watching on YouTube, just leave a like, comment, and subscribe with all that good stuff. And just leave like a comment, we appreciate it. Thanks so much for everybody who came out here for viewing, liking. If you have to stay like the longest, you're one of the coolest fan ever of the Truck and Tractor Boss uh, Farming Simulator 22. And we will find out, like, where the number of measurements is dropping. And we're just going to mark it. 1757 for Rolling Thunder. And the workers are coming up here and getting Rolling Thunder all uh, hooked up. It was 1757. And one total will be heading up now. Everybody, boys and girls, and off on the track. Well, you can see that big sharing of that building. And one total will be parking up there.
And that driver is taking it at his smoking John. Smoking John will be of that driver will be going on to the way station right now. And let's see how much everybody want to see how much that John Deere Detroit tractor is weighing right now. On the right hand side, that's how much it's weighing. It's kind of really different from the case tractor, between like the John Deere, those two are very different. In the driver with the smoking John, we'll be coming on to the track, meeting up with the pulling sled. Smoking John have to be really careful right there. I'm going to slam into him and give that mercenary worker in that pulling sled like a heart attack. Yeah, even that one would be really good. Good right there, they can be like a lot of things can happen with a jump scale. Between the, the John Deere tractor and the pulling sled. And it's a uh, smoking John. Because it's a it's also smoking straight up in the air. And it's a John Deere tractor. Everybody goes and goes. That's why they call it smoking John. Get ready to go when you push your foot down to the to the gas pedal and just get your tires rolling. And we will drop the green. If anything can happen, we will throw the wind flag. And let's see how far everybody smoking jaw of that driver pulling that sled down, down to the track. Everybody. It kind of looks like uh, smoking John and trying to do a pop really just moving back and forth. They're just trying to. If you want to see that, boys and girls, and we can do test running with a Harry Simulator 22 for the wheelies. See if it's working or not. Maybe hopefully it does. And Smoky John is about done with that pulling, and that driver going to stop right there. Woo, he got so close. for the out of bounds, and he just backing up. It looks like a new polling. 107 point looks like 18 for Smoking John. It looks like it's sticking with the 107.18 measurements. And we are staying with that and the workers are unhooking from the polling sled from the John Deal and the pulling sled is dropping the tire down. And if I will pull the brakes back. And smoking John with our driver will be going up there with the rolling thunder.
Yeah, with the uh, with the Poland tractor, with the uh, Case International, we were was wearing it with a uh, red fever. With the uh, Case tractor and the John Deere, we have been wearing each other with the uh, Case class and the uh, John Deere, and red fever is meeting up with the Poland sled. And you will see the driver going forward, going backwards, with all that good stuff. And just trying to figure it out where the, the chain is at. And we will see like how far way people can go or, or even farther than the other case tractor of the World and Thunder. The workers are hooking up of Ray Fever and this is it's a case tractor and it's red it's have a lot of fever. It's red fever everybody. Rain drop when the tire go up, go up to the top. When you press the gas pedal down, driver. And we will throw the flag out. We will throw a green flag and if anything can happen to your tractor, we will throw a red flag. And let's see how far Red Fever is pulling. Yeah, it kind of looks like it of that red fever on that driver. Just not even too far like that other one was going. Just not even have the horsepower out of the speed. Or we might just say we just don't even know. And we will find out, everybody. That kind of looks like red fever might be way farther than the uh, world in thunder. And the race is coming way to the far left with the case international tractor and looks like it's stopping right now. 30.85 of the measurement of Ray Fever. It kind of looks like Ray Fever is stopping right now of the measurements of a 30.85. And the workers are where they come, come one year walking up here and they're unhooking the chain from the pulling slide in, in that tractor. And the workers are unhook the tractor, a uh, red fever, and will be going up with all the others.
Hey, it's recap list on. And the driver was showing on the way station of that how much he was wearing. It was just the same as the other case tractor. And we have another one more case international tractor left. It will be cranky out. Recap list is meeting up with the pulling. Pulling sled. And you can always check out the merchandise at the uh, USA East Polos or the NTB, NTBA. You can check out the t-shirt hats and a lot of great goodies. And even the, you can find like on eBay that your favorite of the uh, tractor supplies. You can find Die cast a one sixty four maybe one twenty four scale somewhere for the tractables and you can find uh hopefully with the pickle truck poles you can find it on eBay and even you can find customized tractors on eBay. And it looks like Recap List is having an issue. And we were just waiting, being patient, everybody. Boys and girls and country farmer, as well as too. Both are we kept this. Uh, unless if you got the, the tractor and the worker and chained up to the pulling sled. It kind of looks like it does. And this is we kept this. And we might have to get the tie down or just keep it here like that. We are going to lay the tire. We'll follow the tire up and we are turning on the measurement of the pulling sled. Whenever you ready, decide to go, recap this. We will drop down the green flag for you. And it's green. Everybody, go, boys and girls, and let's see how far recap this can pull the pulling sled. And up next will be uh, Cranky Up. Then it will be the John Deals. Only three John Deals. Then it will be the pickup truck turn. Then the measurement of the pulling sled, it will show it like how far is the tractor is going taking the sled down to the track if anybody was curious and wondering about it and saving so make it so much a lot easier to track with all the tractors and the pickup trucks and even the semi truck as well as too it looks like we cap this as done with this ball it looks like 24.26 as the measurement and we cap this has been getting like around close to each other. It kind of looks like a uh, battle like, between with a recap list and a uh, red fever. And Cranky Out will be the last one. Even one Thunder as well as two. I forgot to mention about that. With that driver and that team. And the workers are coming. Coming one and the other on hooking. Unhooking the tractor pole right now and recap this with the drama is heading up there with everybody else.
And Craig Gilbert is coming out to the track in that driver was doing a race station and see how much it was really it's probably like with the others I was saying and Cranky up is leaning out with the pulling sled right now and that pulling sled will be the judge of the Cranky up and we're just waiting patiently with the Cranky up and with the driver and even the workers will be just waiting patiently for that draw and the workers will be hooking up the chain to that pulling slate. The pulling slate with the tractor. Pull it forward and get it all straight out quick crank up and this is the last pulling for a K tractor. And this is crank it up. Everybody boys and girls. And let's see how far Cranky up game pool. And we have to wait till the front of the time go, go up and whenever you decide to put your foot down to the gas pedal and we will drop the green flag. Is there any anything we can pull problem or, or breaking down or catch on fire? And we want the red flag. It. Whenever you decide where to go, thank you up. And let's see how far Cranky Up can go down to the track. And the measurement is on, and with the pulling sled with the tractor. And this will be the last one for the case tractor. It can be silent with the uh, cage rentals. With them have been laying, battling while the position now, and it kind of looks like Cranky Up getting in it right there. Just not a good one. 17.58. That nah, cage rental just give up right now. And the weight is going backwards. Crank it up, it's 17.57 for the measurement. And the workers are coming up here and one in. They are working on the chain to get it undone from the tractor and the pulling sled. And the worker is unhooking that tractor of Crank it up was the last case tractor. Boys and girls.
It's gonna be a green and it's gonna be a goblin. It's a green goblin and it's coming on to the pulling track uh, right now. It's another Detroit John Deere tractor. And it's gonna be spooky or it might gonna be scary. And it's a green goblin and it's coming on to the pulling track and it's taking it a sweet time. We'll be coming over the white lines uh, right now. And meeting up with the Portland Slay will be the judge. And it's still taking a sweet time of that John Deal. It's that green Golden. They made it like a choice in with the two jaws. They can choose like one in jaws, two jaws, so don't know if I can choose three. Just one or two jaws. The jaws pipe will be the best. And it's a uh, green goblin. And it's green and it's a uh, goblin. It could be a villain. But the villain have to be respectful with all the rules. Just wait for the tire of for the tire going up. A green goblin driver. When you decide to drop your foot down on the gas pedal and when you start moving and it will be a green flag. If anything can happen, if anything can happen, it will be a, like a red flag, like a mechanical issue, and we're catching on fire, or something happened. But we don't want to see that to happen. And the way is back whenever you decide to be ready to go, Green Goblin. It kind of looks like Green Goblin is ready to go and straighten up. And it's green. And it's Green Goblin. And let's see how far Green Goblin can pull that John Deere tractor down to the track, everybody. And I'm sure come down, come down to check your delicious ice cream in your Oh, popsicle on a stick. We have them in a cone and in a couple. You can deli you can eat delicious, sweet, put in the snacks anytime as you want, or just a nice, yummy, hot or cold food. And a nice cold beverage drink or a bottle. Yeah, I kind of really look kind of really too hard or with a green goblin at the start. We just can't even tell. It could be 82.7 from measurement or it is 62.74 for a green goblin. And the workers are coming up here right now, everybody. And it's changing to 62.73. And that was Green Goblin. And he was nice and played by the walls, everybody.
It is Saturday night, Huckle. Was in the way station and checking out of that driver in the team. See how much it's raining. And right now, of that driver, Saturday night, Huckle, taking his sweet time and coming on to the pulling track. And we'll be going over the white lines. Everybody, boys and girls, and country farmers as well as too. Woo, we got the speed of the drivers, Saturday Night Hooker. It's even those John Deere Detroit, Detroit Jaws that have a lot of speed into them. And we are just getting away impatiently for that Saturday night hooker. This one has a one in jaws. I think the the other one it was a smoking John had a one in one in jaws, I believe so. And we are just waiting well while that driver is pulling backwards. On to the pulling center. And the workers will be hooking up that tractor right now. Pull up, pull up for hours to get everything all straightened out, driver of that Saturday night hooker. And wait for the front tires will be go up, going up. It's not even Saturday, it's gonna be with just a whenever day. It's not even night time, but it will be night soon. It is Saturday night, Uncle. Wish it was even in like a Saturday night. And the worker was hooking the, the pulling tractor to onto it. And it's a uh, Saturday night, Uncle, and it's a uh, green. And let's see how far. Saturday night hooker can go down to the track. Just sit back, relax, enjoy yourself in eating with your nation or buying late souvenirs at the USA East Palace or NTPA. All the good merchandise. Oh, Saturday night hooker go. Swing it, swing it sled sideways, went up now. He just all over the place. He was even all over the place. And Saturday Night Hooker is just about done with that is pulling. And he is stopping right now. 114.43 for Saturday Night Hooker. And the workers are coming up here and checking everything is okay in the back with the pulling slide in the back of the tires, making sure everything is okay and no way from the pulling slide. Looks like slamming really hard to the Saturday night hooker tractor. And it's the 114.43 for the measurements. And the hook. And the workers are unhooking that John Deere tractor. And we have one more left to go. Everybody, boys and girls. Saturday night hooker will be going up, parking with everybody else.
and whiskey while have done the weighing. Say how much that truck of the John Deere is weighing. And whiskey while that driver is coming on to the pulling track at the beginning. And the dirt have changed so much when the dirt is digging and digging straight down into the dirt. And whiskey water and that driver will, will be meeting up with the pole slide. And we're just gonna give it a bit of that driver some time to figure everything out, just waiting and being patiently. And we will see that tractor, that fast one, see how far that risky or that semi is going to be wired down there. It's not everywhere really good for you, it's just a country, must be a country farmer and probably like a trucker driver. How risky wire, how like a side of the truck. And it's not even good for you, of that drink. Wait till you get a lot older. Don't recommend you drinking it. When you pass that limit. It's whiskey wild. When it, when the tire will for the tire will go up and when you put your foot down to the gas pedal. Pull, pull the tractor up a little bit. And it's kind of looks like it's green and we're just going to drop it anyways. And let's see how far whiskey water can go. Everybody boys and girls. And that tractor is trying to pop away. Just trying to. And let's see how far that traffic can get get to. And oh, I see that traffic got really scrolling and just keep it, keep it on going. See, just like moving side by side, just wiggling it. And must be getting a lot tighter. Look in the front, oh, that's going to be in a whiskey wire right there. 95.86 for whiskey wire. And the chain just came loose. Or just snap off. And a change up. We're still keeping in 96. And we were saying. And that is it for the case tractors. And with the John Deere tractors. Whiskey Wire was the last one. Boys and girls. And Whiskey Wire will be heading up there. And with everybody else, Trato. And his pickup truck's turn.
Now it's the pickup truck stunt. Just bringing what you brought in and say, even those pickup truck drivers, they are pretty big team. And this is a full pickup truck right here. And it's overkill. Overkill is coming onto the track. And meeting up with the porn slide. I kind of really think it's a full pick of chocolates and a Chevy I don't think it's a full diesel pick of truck and it's hooking up onto the pulling truck. It's a full diesel truck and it's a uh, overkill. Just wait for the front, all the tires go up on the pole sled, and they will be going up. And yes, the uh, pulling sled have been changed. The pulling tractor sled is, is done in this uh, pulling, the second pulling sled for the pickup truck. They have less weight than the tractors. Whenever you decide to ready to go, we put your foot down the gas pedal and we will drop the flag. And overkill is just sitting right there just waiting just patiently and getting the call to go. And now the one of the tires is going up. If there's a mechanical issue or a, or a fire or something happened, we will throw a red flag. And it's overkill. And let's see how far that pickup truck can go. Everybody, boys and girls. It's just whoever getting me that fastest or wherever they brought me, wherever they brought me at, at Jefferson County Fairground on Farming Simulator 22. And their parking is going to be way different than the tractors and the semis. And overkill is still going, everybody. And it's coming to the end of his or her run. And what a great job. It's 106 point 42. Now it's dropping down to 106 point 39 M. A measurement of overkill. It's a, another one for overkill at 106.39 of that measurements. And the workers will be unhooking the pulling sled from the pickup truck. It's a, another pull for that full diesel truck.
It's going to be my Melissa. Looks like the name on that that dog's pulling truck. Oh, that pickup truck with the one smokestack. It's coming onto the track right now and meeting up with the pulling sled. And then I've done like the rain station with the phone. We didn't even mention about it. With a full pickup truck, uh, with that diesel, we have way different from the Dodge pulling truck. Those Dodge pulling trucks will be about the same with each other or similar. Other ways in there pulling. Okay, driver. Other mod, Melissa. And it's a uh, mud, Natalia. Yes, wait for the, for the tires to go up. And we will let you know. Driver. And the front of the tire is going up on the pulley sled. As right now, just be safe, be careful out there on pulling track. Whenever you decide to get, go, my Matilda, and we will drop the flag right now. And let's see how far that driver can, can go with that, that Dodge diesel pulling truck. Could it be the Fords, or could it be the Dodge, or could it be the Chevy going to win it? All different team in different brand of trucks in pulling trucks. It kind of feels like for the Dodge, Dodge Ram or for the pulling truck, it looks like the driver kind of feels like, man, this feels like a competition, just not even joke. And yes, it is. It feels like a competition at pulling and just a pulling off at Jefferson kind of feel. For the farming simulator 22. And that driver stop right there. Just not even much far. 18.83 for Mud Matilda. Right now, I see 18.84 of the measurements. And the workers are coming out here. Unhooking the chain from the pulling sled from the pulling truck of that Dodge Ram. It is 18.84 from what Marty Matilda, and that's the one, that's the last time we, we're going to say it, boys and girls. And friends, excuse me for that thing. With the alarm going up and back out there, it looks like a cube car back in the parking lot. Yes, whoever it is, please come down and turn the alarm off. And thank you very much.
It's another of the Dodge Ram of the pulling truck diesel and it's a uh, radio maker. Radio maker of that driver will be coming on to the pulling truck right now. And radio maker in that driver was going over the way station where everybody can see that. Those dog rims are going to be way different. Then the other truck like the Chevy and the Dodge. And these are the Dodge pulling teams. Oh, do just the Dodge pulling brands. And the worker has hooking up a way to make a. And this is Red Omega. Everybody, boys and girls. Java, just wait for the for the tires go up on the pulling sled, and we will let you know what in the information about it. Remember, driver, when the from the tires on the pulling sled. Coming out, it's coming out right now for you. Just put your foot down to the gas pedal and just, just go. When, whenever you decide to move in, pulling in, we will drop down the green flag. If anything happens, it will be a red flag. And let's see how far Radio Maker is moving. And the weight is moving and the tire is up. It kind of looks like a very slow. Just a force of the competition with these Dodge Ram pulling trucks. It seems like it's been kind of rather hard competition with these, with our Dodge pulling trucks and how much in the weight boxes in there it's gonna feel a lot lot heavier when it gets in the front of the weight and it's coming in and that drove have to do everything again looks like it's gonna stop pacing right, right here 12.58 other measurement for weather maker. And that is there for the pulling truck of the We will have two more of these Dodge Rams pulling trucks. And it dropped down to 12.57 measurements. And we are taking 12.57 for weather maker. And that, and the workers have unhooked, unhooked of that driver, of that window maker truck. And we'll be joining with all the others pickup trucks. Up next looks like a Chevy truck. And we will find out the name if I'm correctly with that.
And this is Addicted, yes, another porn truck. And my apologies from it, and everybody, boys and girls, and country farmers. We thought we must have had it one. It was not a Chevy truck, it was a Dodge. Or the Dodge Rim. And Addicted is coming on to the pulling track. And made it up with the pulling sled. And that drama with the Addicted is making it up. And it will be the judge. See how far that Dodge Rim pulling, pulling truck can go. Right now, it's just backing up. And we just being, being patient and just waiting. And this is how addicted everybody. And the world could have chained out the pulling slide to that truck. And we just gonna wait for for the front of the pulling sled and it's staying right now. Whenever you drop your your foot down to the gas pedal, whenever you ready to go and decide to go. We wanna drop the green flag for you. And it, and it's green flag and everything is good to go. For addicted, oh, 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 oh. Hopefully, everybody enjoying the show of the of the tractor pulls is done, and the pickup truck is just about done. You know the way. We just only have two more pickup truck. Then the semis will be coming out for the fun of it. Addicted is going pretty slow right now. And let's still see how far that Dodge Ram pulling truck can go. And it will be just about the end for that addicting. It was very, not even very much addicting for even watching. But what a great job for that driver. There's the end of the point for addicted, not even that far. Looks like 3.94 or 13.94 for addicted. It looks good. Like looks like 3.94 measurements for that driver of addicted. And the workers uh, came up here working on the chain, unhooking it. We'll be unhooking it right now. And our dictator will be meeting up with, with our other pulling trucks. Other pickup.
Yes, indeed, we will find out what this Chevy or pickup truck. He just what just won you just, just what you won. We just don't even know. I have no clue. What is, is the name of it that we will find out? We can get hopefully get out close to it. It's not really good lead wings for that old Chevy pickup truck. And he's coming on to the pulling truck now. They're meeting up with the uh, pulling sled. And it will be the judge. And that driver is pulling back on us right now. And the workers are hooking up that truck right now. And we will hopefully find out just that name on the truck. It looks like really hard, hard to tell between the colors and that truck. We just don't know. And this is, we're just going to call it just an old Chevy pickup truck. And just wait for the for the weight to go backwards and just being respectful and just sit and relax and just sit in that pickup truck just for right now. And the front of the tires is going up. And it looks like just pull away right for that's good. Yeah, we even thought the that Chevy pickle Chevy pickle truck was gonna go pull for, for the most of the excitement one. And the screen. The flag in the head the work going ahead dropping it down. Let's see how far that Chevy truck can go. Absolutely, that truck you have just having no problems going like the father as uh, other trucks, especially the, the Dodge Rams. Who it is? Uh, very careful. Hang on there right now. He is, that driver is on danger zone. He's on the near side of danger zone. That would have been really bad. Hit that pulling sled, getting snack in. And what a great one for that old Chevy truck pickup. 98.6 uh, measurement, 98.61 for that Chevy pickup truck. Looks like we're sticking with that 96. 98, 98.61. And the workers are coming up there, unhooking the pulling truck, and why they one for it. The last pulling truck will be dig and deep. Then we're gonna take a break for a while, make everybody relax, enjoying themselves, and eating delicious food, and Drinking cold drinks, eating yummy food, or just buying merchandise at the website, or or just get, getting free mods for the for the farming simulator 22. Have tractor pulls you can get, and something just even you can get. You're just even with it just to buy on Patreon.
And it will be digging deep in the driver of the pulling truck is where he's coming onto the pulling truck uh, right now and going over past the white lines and meeting up with the danger gen of the judge. And that pulling sled will be the judge of it when they're pulling down the track. We will see how far digging deep will go. There's even happening a lot of digging deep. They like all this stuff with the tractor and the other pickup trucks. The dirt have been changing so much. When tires are digging, back tire, front tire, they just dig it as much as they can. And this will be digging deep. Yes, wait for the front of the tiles to go up on the pulling sled. And uh, and uh, the tiles on the front is pulling out and uh, Let's see how far Dag and Dave came pulling that truck down to the track with a pulling sled on the judge. And make a good one. And this one is the last pulling truck. We have done all the tractors. And this will be the last pulling truck is a Dag and Dave. I mean, just not much of digging it, just not enough horsepower in the pickup truck. It kind of looks like he just gonna end it right there. Hey, buddy. At 9.06 of the measurement for digging it, just not even good. Just fully one for that driver. And it's 9.05 for digging deep. Just not a good one. And, and the pulling sled, the worker is just pulling the sled backwards while that driver just waiting patiently in that pickup truck. Anyway, just gonna make it a lot easier and just take the sled backwards. Just not even much far. While well, the truck is just sitting there. And hopefully everybody having a good day enjoying themselves so far of this event. At Brad to the Bone Polos. And right now we are taking care of the full sled. And get it out, out the way. And just making it, everything so much a lot easier. And we're just going to take the pulling, pulling slide back. And later on tonight, if it's going to rain, we're just going to keep it rolling. If it's on the story lightning at any time or just a noise, we're just going to end it. And did not pull us ball for you. Ball for you didn't even win. And we are going to take a break time. Everybody, boys and girls, just go down whenever and and get in delicious food. Just whenever as you want while the worker is taking care of everything. And then just for a break time. At the 
Call me same later 22. For the Jefferson County Field. For the trucking tractor pulls. Uh, right to the band pulls. And this is your announcer. Uh, myself, uh, voicing everything in. At Rat to the Bone Gaming RC. And with all that good stuff. Just sit back, relax whenever. As you want, or just grab something good to eat or, or water. Well, everybody, ever know, last call, last call with the. You can get your del delicious food of ice cream in the car, in the car, or get a good candy bar or some, something sweet and good. And come on down and get your hot food and yummy food whenever as you want. Well, doing the events for the, at the Farming Simulator 22 at Brad to the Bone Gaming RC. There's all going to be much more coming in the Water of Outlaw Sprinkles. We'll be at 34 Richway. What El Dos It's gonna be one of those two. And uh Dirt Lake models will be taking on that Bristol at uh, all factor. And then what about Lost Pickles will be at on all factor as well as too. And much and much more is coming down at Rats of the Bone Gaming or C. And while we are taking a good break, big time.
back and the summer trucks was pulling down and everybody was just walking around and doing their stuff. And we were just taking care of things as well as to and the weather are starting to change right. And sunset is and the sun is going down and it will be the semi trucks. And no oh no, it looks like rain is coming. And it's starting drizzling and down for raining. And we are just going to keep the show as going on. We're just not going to leave it all. We're just going to keep on going for everybody who is watching on on YouTube and Brad to the Bone Gaming on C for the event time. Hello, Brad to the Bone pull us. And it will be the semi trucks gonna be playing in the mud at the pulling track at Jefferson County Fair at Farming Simulator 22. And it's starting to get dark outside pretty soon. The sun is going down. And it will be a last call, like a final call to get. A, Get your delicious food and ice cream, all that good stuff. The event is almost just like end of the show. Of the last show is a farming same later twenty two for the semi trucks. We have tickets Macamus Ultimus Prime or Elizabeth Prime. We have Trista Kitty and Sneaky Pig and Mr. Nasty on Bendel. And we have that blue truck. Can't, can't even think of the name. And it changed and it's got dark outside. <laughs> and we have Stella Boy and Five Cats Cross Fever too. Stella Boy is going for it.
And Silver Bullet is, is coming on to the pulling track. And meeting up with the, of the judge and everything that been changed. Right now with the weights. We'll be on the top of the pulling sled now. And the pulling sled have changed it as well as two. It was just a chain now. It's just like a weight box thing full of semi trucks. And they just have to back it up. It's just kind of pretty easy and simple for them. Then like the tractors and the pickup trucks. And we are back, everybody, boys and girls. And Sarah is just hooking up that semi truck. It was an inconvenient thing from that. And we will get that fixed. And this is a famous truck, and it's uh, on Farmer Simulator 22, Silver Bullet. Whenever you're ready to go, and we get to have to turn the safety lights on, and we, the flagman will drop the green if anything happens, Silver Bullet, of that driver, and it's green. And everything is good to go. And let's see how far Sarah Bullock can, can go down to the track. Everybody, boys and girls. These, these semi-trucks will be going down so far down to the track. And we know uh, have a hard time like showing showing with the uh, measurements but we will find out and all the and all the all the semi poles. And it will show them all like the tractable, the pickle trucks, they miss the same eyes. And that looks like that another, another pull for that same truck. For Selma Bullet! And we'll find out who is up next for the pulling truck. For the pulling semi trucks. And the worker is coming over there. The workers don't even have to this time. Oh, thank goodness with it. The semi trucks, they can just unhook it by themselves. Just like that. And they can head up there with the, uh, they will be with the tractors. With the semi trucks and the tractors. And that was several bullet.
his own segment from NSI Cleaning Up Truck and it's coming on to the third truck and moving up with the four lane sled. This is a really nice looking on a semi truck and an on the on the list. Those two are favorite things, and just only that one. Any lady butterfly was having a big time issue, and for the workers and the team, just to get her out, won't be pulling of this tonight for a semi. Butterfly won't be. Doing that for you. Maybe the next time. Yeah, hopefully this is all good. I guess I have a lot of things to talk to me. When it's going forward down the track, this is with our two arm bending each other down to the track, and we'll see how far that's in my truck can go. And we will find out for each semi truck our left after I end up tonight. I found some later going to. And this is all oh, the so Let's see how far that's going to go. And it's green. The truck was just pulling for it, and now it's green. The family has got it down. It's just a rainy night. I the I probably going to be just the same kind of And let's see everybody how far I'll be in the And what I'm not taking a And what I'm going to do And the home band of that girl is getting frustrated up on the ass. And it's getting a lot tougher. It might be tougher for a few of us. But it's just getting too bad and really good. And we'll say it's kind of got a father. It might be farther than the other kids. And it's so boring. And that girl just has to do just on the poster. And go up to just all the trackers and that. Uh, and that was all of them It's a brand new truck. It's not even the blue, I think it was a blue one. It was a brown one. It's a brand new
Hey, you know the female truck and it's a blue one? I see W-I-N-C. Must be some kind of company or a team. Even the semi truck, they can bring their own company and can bring all together. We're all in the female truck of that S-O-W. I see. Yes, hit the police lane. Flip it on the, on the side. This not a really good sign for the driver and the safety crew and the rescue is coming down and making sure everything is okay and all right. And hopefully our good prayers for that driver is all right. Just not even a good start and probably like a lot of damage on that semi truck. And the workers are walking it back and forth while the driver did just help it in. Looks like it's fine. But it's, it's not gonna fall. It will be DNF. That Jefferson kind of feel good. Maybe next time for that semi truck. No pulling. And it's time for the Cat's Grass Fever Turn and meeting up with the pony sled. It's another family truck and on Family Simulator 22 by me. It's just not, not even by me with a model. Just giving them all a shout out. They're like a, such a great family's job and I just don't like the the name, names and logos, even like the flames. Just like an add-on. The workers and the, the team as the team and the driver had done like a nice job and it's a big name as team. And this is Gas Grass Fever will be pulling. When you put when you push on the gas pedal and it will be a green flag for you. If something happened to you like anything, it will be a red flag. And it's green for cat scratch fever. Let's see how far you can pull. Could the uh, miss the mercy cat scratch fever? Several bullets. Don't do that. Welcome, Artemis. Mr. Nasty. Kirby. Just a kitty. 
could be any of those semi trucks. We will find out and then see how the end of the results. That rat to the bone. Pull us. Boys and girls and country farmers last day. We just have a few more trucks left to go. And Lady Butterfly won't be wanting. Too much issues. Yeah, oh, there's a. No relegation really in the car, catch those people. Hopefully, the jelly's all right, smacking with our concrete right, right now. And that point sled just slam right into the semi truck of catch those people. Hopefully, the job is okay and safety crew and the rescue team is. It's coming down there and checking on the. Hopefully, it's all. That driver is okay and all right. Yeah, check anything for safety concern. And that truck is okay and fine with that driver. He's, that, uh, that driver probably going to be sore. It, just getting limp black truck right beside the other one. And just park it right there. And that's the done for with a catch crush fever.
Tennis, uh, version, version, uh, version of is coming on to the porn track and meeting up with our porn friend. And it's a not about in a way a great leader leadership. Let's see if it has a leader seven going down for the track. With a pulling slide on the pulling slide, will it be friendly or is it going to be the enemy? We will find out, everybody. Well, that driver is hooking up onto the onto the pulling pulling slide. Oh, we should have caught this, caught it, caught it. Legend is a uh, primal. It's, it's saying legend, 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 primus. And this is legend of this primal. And it's Optimus Prime. And it's a not a bot. It might come here, I'll train for him, it's just for him and uh, <laughs> we just, we will find out where it's just how Java was a big fan of Optimus Prime. We, we are just, just give it a second or a minute and let the uh, white, white boss go and pull it backwards from the incident from the cat's crust river and that Java is all right and okay. Just give it time and patient right here. And the weight box is going back at the beginning of the of that sleigh. Well that driver just this rating being Just relaxing and mining, far in there, whatever everybody do, in the pulling trucks. Just back up, just back up. That's what I'm saying. Back to the beginning. Oh, 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 oh. Whenever you're ready, just have to go. You will drop the flag for a green. And this is Legimus uh, Prime. And it's Legimus Prime. And let's see how far of that big fan of the Transformers of Autobot going down for a track. Hopefully it'll be a legend or it'll just be a great leader going down to the track. See how far it can go. He's just only going to have female trucks and Lady Butterfly just going to stay out there. And they will think about packing everything up and they just going to get everything going for them. They could have won, they look at the next one. And we will be heading down to this one level. And that's the end of the poll for the Legend of Mr. Prime. And that driver will be unhooking it. And that Legend of Prime is was a great leader. Got Jefferson kind of feel. Hopefully to see that semi truck again next slide is whenever. Few more trucks left to go. Sneaky feet. Just a kitty and Mr. Nasty. And that was a good point and ending it with the uh, Legend of Farmers and with that driver. Anyway, so just give that one a full pull. And that driver just getting a pocket right there.
was a really good drama and a popular one. It is Twisted King of a King Wolf Drug. Coming on to the following track and Black King is going to be very interested and wild on the track with the opponent's sled, but it's going to be a judge how Tristan of that kid is going to be. It was a cast cross reveal, and this one is Tristan Kitty. And it's pulling. And it's a can work to it. Now it's night time, and it's raining down for raining. We did like a switch off a uh, safety car to turn all the lights on. And this is Twisted Kitty. And let's see how far that drama can keep Twisted Kitty down, down to the pulling track. I think the leader is... Legend of Primus and, and it's green. And let's see how far just the kitty can take that truck down to just only two more trucks are left to go. Mr. Nasty and Sneaky Pete. And that will be all folks till the results will be coming in. So the tractor force will be coming in pretty soon in the pickup trucks and the same on trucks and in. It looks like our Tristan Kitty is having a really good good pulling so far. You just never don't want to get on the white line. He's on the metro, he's on the dangerous train. Woo, that was very close. It was, that girl was taking that truck, semi truck off. We don't know if we should call it or don't even know if we should give that point for Tristan Katie. It seems like going on, going out, should we give Tristan Kitty the points for it? Oh, should we not, everybody, boys and girls? Just leave a comment down below. And that's uh, the end of pulling for Tristan Kitty. Should we give it or should we don't give it to it? Give it to that driver. Up next, it looks like Mr. Nasty in that black truck. The sneaky feet will be last. It kind of looks like it. Two more trucks left to go.
There's Mr. Nasty right now. All my Paul Malone Yamin and tribute of the Farmer's Thing Radio 22 of a great driver. And this is a tribute of Mr. Nasty. Mr. Nasty and that driver is coming on to the track. We're going to see him doing good for us. And there will be a new update. Oh, wait. It is a mixer and it is going to be a nasty drug. Don't miss with me. And while that job is figuring out to get everything all straightened up, and yes, indeed, it will. For the next event, it's going to be. And the new stuff will be going on to Mr. Nasty. Now I just a plane truck. And, uh, and that driver is trying to figure out, working it on, hooking it, you know, trying to get everything else right now. Well, I'm just going to take a break from my voicing. I'll be back to the bone, uh, Polis. And it looks like that job finally got it. Great job. Up next, after a while, when Mr. Nasty is done with his poll, it will be Sneak Up Heat. And this is Mr. Nasty and his back and playing Peter Belt truck. Yeah, Mr. Nasty couldn't get it done on the way at any time. He just like, we just, just have to do it without it. There will be a new one. Everybody, boys and girls. And this is Mr. Nasty and his screen phone. Let's see how far. Oh, looks like it wasn't rain. Fast stop, fast stop, for Mr. Nasty. We even thought that girl was going mostly the white box. Mostly something happened oh, with an issue with the. Uh, now, what color this slide? Well, that imaginary. Look or always always uh, Mr. Nasty. He is doing V1 right now. Well we just sit back, relax and enjoy everything while the weight box is going backwards to the beginning and Mr. Nasty will be doing his pull. Hopefully nothing happened to the future. And this is Mr. Nasty is pulling right now. Just not in, just not in that fast or, or quick on that Peter Belt truck. Let's just see well will that Peter Bell 357 or 389 Peter Bell will end up at. Well, Mr. Nasty will be doing up when he's done with his pulling. Then it will be a sneaky peek turn to take a one and go at it. And Lady Butterfly is still sending up there. And that's a good one for, for the first one of Mr. Nasty in the Farmer Simulator 22 of that driver. He and his in for right there. Yeah, you could even go like farther, but something issue must be happening. We just don't know. Something give up inside the truck and still going. 
Last ball of the sneaky pig. And Mr. Nelson will be heading up with our other trucks. Well, or just head up with those two trucks. And pull for Mr. Nasty.
is my final pull for the semi truck. And now the semi truck ready. And the truck is ready to head out of here. There's a lot of some different ones. And some of the same ones is that have different kind of things. I found the same way to turn to. We're getting a little sneak of me on that guy for the other thing out. I'll back it up. And this is the last hole. Okay, sneak of me and put the truck to the point side. And this is Snicker Beat. You guys see it, Snicker. It's a people Snicker out there. Not anybody at all. Or just you can. That's how you say my truck. It's going to be Snicker, Snicker. It's going to be Snicker Beat. And Sneaky Bit is going in his green. And let's see how far I'm going to go. Let's see how far I'm Sneaky. I'm Sneaky Bit to the ground now. That's how it is. It's a green. That's not going to be. And we will find out. We'll 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 find out. I'm not going to be And thank you so much for coming. We will see you at the table. And we are pushing on. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to Hey, we are pissed you all. So I just really like it. Probably this, this, this way is okay. But we just push the uh, the stay safe, stay dry, stay healthy. Don't get a shame, just stay safe out there. Have a word. And we appreciate you all. We will see you next time. Probably will be at 34 Westway or Eldor Westway, or it might be Bristol with the adult late models. It's going to be one of those three. We will find out and see. Of that event. It's probably going to be close to Halloween time. <laughs>